weeks to go. I'm um, speaking of red. Mm. So item number two, do you ever get frustrated in the kitchen when your pots, though you love them, don't have a spout? Mm -hmm. Or do you get frustrated with having to grab colanders and mm -hmm. then one's not clean? Mm -hmm. You are giving <laughs> us something this morning that's going to put an instant colander and spout on Every, on every pot and pan that we own. Every pot and pan, you get two sizes. They are flexible, so they'll work with any size pot. They'll work with any material, cast iron, enamel, painted enamel, stainless steel, hard anodized, will never arm, harm anything. It'll work on temptations. It'll work on glass. Here's the secret. We gave you two silicone clips that are stainless steel embodied, but encased in silicone. So I can go like this. I'm going to take these two. This is a non-stick Cook's Essentials pan with hard anodized on the outside. I boiled some peas and carrots. Sorry, we got a theme with you with the vegetables. <laughs> it's all for brie, by the way, okay? Thank you. So I clip this on after I've cooked. Now, this is pure silicone. No heat is ever going to dissipate and hold on to here. So if you want to, you can put this before you start cooking, put it right on. My suggestion is because I don't want to get in the way of stirring or adding ingredients, put it on after. In a boiling hot, this is boiling hot water, and I can put this on, no worries. I'm going to grab my pot. I'm going to go over here, guys, to the sink and show you. With that clip, with that ease, I'm able to take my peas and strain them out. A couple jumpers in there. <laughs> they're all with all especially with the peas, they're so tiny. Well, look at that. Two hands free. Now, by the way, I can actually drop this down if I wanted to and lay it down. And then you it can actually walk away. keeps a stand if you want it to be all drained out, okay? So now you've got a colander built in to any pot that you have. Well, let me show okay. everybody the colors because everything has Easy Pay today in mm -hmm. honor of cooking on Q. Easy Pay on this is seven dollars and twelve cents, and you get two. So total price twenty one thirty six, but monthly budget friendly payments of seven dollars and twelve. Great. How great! I know we just got more back in stock, so some great colors to choose from. Here's your black. Here is your red that can go with your red can opener if you want to add that to your order. The green is what we're calling olive green, and it truly is an olive green. And then you've got a wonderful eggplant purple and then a nice classic blue down here. Yes, you get both of them. And Mark Charles, why do you use the smaller versus the larger? Oh, it's just size. That's all. So but just to show smaller. you something that Amy just pointed out, I'm going to take the larger one. I've got six different materials of pots, sizes and shapes, just to show you how easy. Now, this this Rachel Ray pot, okay, this is a three quart. I would have probably taken the smaller one, but just to show you how even the larger one conforms around that. See, when you when you put the larger and the small, this goes up higher, so you could probably get bigger pieces like cauliflower or broccoli will not get jumped out on you. So there's the three quart, right? Hard anodized. Here is a two a two and a half quart ten inch saute pan. Works great if you're going to be doing uh, bacon fat and uh, doing uh, meats. Then of course here's an everything pan in four quarts. Different nonstick. Look at this Gigundo guy. This is fits children, um, <laughs> so I don't know what you're cooking in. But low uh, pasta bo uh, bakes and low boils inside of that. Okay, this is a 22 quart. This is an eight quart stock pot, nonstick, and then cast iron, six quart, cast iron. Fits and conforms onto every pot, makes it a strainer. So I don't care what cookware you have, which I love. Then more importantly, if you ever want to rinse vegetables, and you want to put them in. A bowl, uh, glass bowl. They work in glass bowls. They work on temptations. Look at that. Oh, so imagine so if I'm going to take some apples or some grapes, wash them out, and I get to strain out all that water. Okay? And colanders take a lot more room to store. And then we need all different mm -hmm. sizes. I mean, you're already getting two sizes here. They fit with every pot and every pan, and you're getting them on an easy pay of seven dollars and twelve cents. So let's do this. We got some shrimp. We're okay. Some shrimp. We're going to bring it over here, guys. And to show you, one-handed, I got the shrimp. And again, the key is, I would say, is that's a smaller pan. I use a larger one because the shrimp are larger, and I wanted to give them a good shake. So just use a larger one when you've got bigger pieces like shrimp or broccoli in a smaller pan, because this will pucker up and will capture more in there. So all those shrimp are in there, nothing's falling out, and that I can red, give it a nice shape. Sorry, that red that you're using, it's okay. the most popular this morning. So don't wait on the red. And then there's black and olive, eggplant purple and blue. Remember, you get both of them for that great price in 21 okay. inches. So again, when you're straining out. Um, I'm gonna. I'm a right. So grease, so, not just water. Grease, no, oh yeah, grease, anything. Yeah, this is. Yeah, this is not just for water either. So I'm gonna bring this over here, guys, to so the measuring cup to show you something. So you can actually pour out. Uh, this is hard to do it backwards, and I apologize ahead of time. Can I, am I getting You're doing it? it? Yeah, great. great. Backwards, by the way, <laughs> looking at the camera. Don't do this at home. Try to do it face forward. <laughs> but the beauty is, so I'm straining out all of that grease. Look at all the fat I'm reducing from there. I can't get over how hard this is to do backwards. And my, and my right hand, but it's okay. Hey, it's all about television. It's working. <laughs> so being able to do that and pull it out like that and then stop. So here's the beauty that I just did all my ground beef, strained it out with no extra collar. What do you normally do? I, my mom used to take a wooden spoon 
and try to trap all the grease from falling out. And, and then you lose a lot of ground beef so or a lot of ground much. turkey. Well, we just got more back in stock. Easy pays there if you're interested. Payments of $7.12. One more time before we go show you the easiest yep. way to cook your eggs. We've got eggplant, we've got blue, we've got olive, we've got red, and we've got black. Water or that oil that we do mm -hmm. not want to eat. K42383. Yes, and we got our corn on the cob, pasta, top chalkboard time. You'll <laughs> love these. All right, we're going to walk to the chalkboard, but as we go, I want to let you know, come